Hallelujah. I'm the eldest of seven in our home and so due to that my mother taught me how to cook and from there I love the uh, opportunity of cooking, I love cooking and so I decided to pursue it. Normally the uh, bread would finish and in, in, in our home about uh, around Friday night and so Saturday night we have to make like 21 roti because of how much of us in the home and it has to last until um, until Saturday morning when we bake again. I joined the police force on the 15th of December 1982 and while I was working at um, Mr. Bornham residence I went into his kitchen I did not see him around the fridge and so um, a young lady was making roti and while she was making roti I said um, you're doing it wrong you're making the thing wrong and um, the president turned and said um, constable wash your hands and teach her to make it and so I went wash my hands and teach her um, teach her how to make it and he looked at me pass he pinched a piece of the uh, roti and he had not said anything but from there, he sent me to Carnegie. Um, unfortunately, when I went back to work with him in 85, he died. Yeah, I would have, I would have gone and cooked him. Because he sent me to Carnegie, he sent me to other cooking institute to learn to cook. So that I could have gone back and cooked with him. To me, the best part is when you, you finish your meal and you look over and you see. Uh, what you prepare, how it looks, and people eat your food, you feel good. Before I was retired, I was working with um, Mr. Granger. I was fortunate to work with Mr. Granger. Um, before Mr. Granger, I was privileged also to work with Mr. Hoyt. I worked with Mr. Hoyt when Burnham died in 85, and Mr. Hoyt took over. I worked along with Mr. Hoyt. Um, I was his personal attendant. Um, we used to have to taste food and, and cook and stuff like that. So. One of the things that I really want to do is homemade bread. Um, I love homemade bread and uh, there's not much people out there that is doing homemade bread. I used to do it, um, over two, three hundred I used to produce every Tuesday and Saturdays. And um, my aim and determination is to continue that. That is my, uh, my goal. I'm a proud father. I love my wife, I love my children. And I thank God that he's able to help me to provide for them, to help them to grow and, you know, see they um, educated, see they being educated. Now my daughter's at UG and I'm, you know, glad. But um, it's a very good thing to be a father. <laughs>